Hello guys and welcome to another video. Now you can support us to create more free contents by buying us a coffee. Check out the link in the description below and thanks a lot. Are Eric and Ladar still together? Where are they now? We all remember the former 90 day fiancé couple Eric and Leda from season 6 and their messy relationship. Many 90 day fiancé fans have assumed that the couple won't make it together. Now it's been many years from their appearance on the show. Have they managed to stay together or are they going done for good? Stay tuned and let's dive in together into more details. Easy Facts Buzz Breathe Entertainment Eric Rosenbrock and Leda Margarita are 90 day fiancé stars who are widely perceived as mean people. And the fact that they are still at DU surprises many franchise fans. The pair appeared in season 6 of the hit TLC international romance show. Leda infuriated audiences due to the way she treated Eric's daughter, Tasha. Eric shockingly backed Leda's choice to mistreat his daughter after declaring Eric and Leda major show villains. 90 Day Fiancé fans weighed in on the news that the couple is still married and seemingly going strong. Indonesian woman Leda joined her American partner Eric in Wisconsin after they met on an international dating website. Leda immediately made fans skeptical as she claimed she came from an extremely wealthy family. She also said she was a model and doctor. Most shocking was the way Leda treated Eric's child. Leda was upset that Eric paid child support for his kids. After clashing with Eric's daughter Tasha, Leda kicked the teenager out of her home and obtained a restraining order against the young girl. Eric controversially backed Leda's decision. In 2019, police investigated the domestic abuse situation at the couple's home. Leda accused Eric of pulling her hair and Eric alleged that she had threatened to kill herself with a knife. The same year, Leda was granted a four-year restraining order against Tasha. The Instagram fan account 90 Day Fiancé Update shared a picture of Eric and Leda with the caption, Eric and Leda still going strong? Did you think they would make it? Many commenters voiced that they were shocked to see the couple stay together. Whoa, very surprised. She did not treat his daughters very kindly, one fan wrote. Others agreed that Leda's scold attitude made them surprised that Eric was still with her. No, she didn't come over as a very nice person or love and partner. I would have predicted she was off once her was in. Another commenter voiced. Not in a million years. Another viewer wrote. Some commenters also broached an important subject, as many thought the well-being of Tasha was more important than Eric and Leda's relationship. The question should be, is he being a better father to his daughter? One person wrote. As Eric sided with Leda, there aren't many fans who believe that Eric is now a better father. Others thought it made sense that the villainous couple would stay together, though the reasons weren't positive. Why not? She's a demanding show and he is too much of a wuss to stand up to her. He said on air he is afraid of being alone and his possibilities were dwindling. He put her before his children, someone remarked. Overall, 90 Day Fiancé stars are surprised that anyone could make a marriage to Leda work given her selfish and cruel actions and suspicious past. Leda is considered the ultimate 90 Day Fiancé franchise villain by many fans. A lot of people think that Eric deserves to be with Leda given the shocking way he refused to defend his own child. Eric and Leda are a chaotic 90 day fiancé couple, but there are 90 day fiancé fans who think they deserve one another. Few want them to appear in new 90 day fiancé content. Meanwhile, Angela Deem has taken Leda's place as the leading female villain who is still being cast. What do you think guys about this? Please leave us your comments in the section below so we can know your opinions and don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell for more content. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.